Swimming has produced many amazing athletes who have achieved remarkable feats in the pool. In this video, I will present to you the top 10 swimmers of all time, based on their achievements, records, and legacy. Let's dive in. At number 10, we have Kristen Otto Kristen. Otto is a German swimmer who made history at the 1988 Seoul Olympics by becoming the first woman to win six gold medals in a single games. She won the 50 meter, 100 meters, and 200 meter freestyle, the 100 meter backstroke, the 100 meter butterfly, and the 4 by 10 meter medley relay, setting Olympic records in five of those events. She also held the world records in the 100 meters and 200 meter freestyle, and the 100 meter backstroke. Otto was a versatile and dominant swimmer who competed for East Germany, a country that was notorious for its state-sponsored doping program. However, Otto never tested positive for any banned substances and maintained her innocence throughout her career. She retired from swimming in 1989 and became a sports journalist and commentator. At number 9 we have Debbie Meyer. Debbie Meyer is an American swimmer who was the first female swimmer to win three individual gold medals at a single Olympics, doing so at the 1968 Mexico City Games. She won the 200 meter, 400 meter, and 800 meter freestyle, setting world records in all three events. She was only 16 years old at the time and became the youngest ever female Olympic champion in swimming until 1992. Meyer also set world records records in the 100 meter and 200 meter freestyle and won 19 national titles. She was named the Associated Press Athlete of the Year in 1969 and received the James E. Sullivan Award as the top amateur athlete in the United States. She retired from swimming in 1972 and was inducted into the International Swimming Hall of Fame and the United States Olympic Hall of Fame. At number 8, Christina Egersigi. Kristina Egersigi is a Hungarian swimmer who is one of the greatest backstroke specialists of all time. She won five Olympic gold medals, three of them in the 200-meter backstroke at the 1988, 1992, and Nike also won the 100-meter backstroke and the 400-meter individual medley events, retired from swimming in 1996, and became a member of the International Olympic Committee. At number 7 we have Grant Hackett. Grant Hackett is an Australian swimmer who is widely regarded as the best distance freestyler of all time. He won the 1500-meter freestyle at the 2000 and 2004 Olympics, becoming the third swimmer to achieve this feat. He also won the 400-meter freestyle in 2000 and the 4x 200-meter freestyle relay in 2000 and 2004 collecting a total of seven Olympic medals. He held the world record in the 1500-meter freestyle for 10 years, from 2001 to 2011, and also set world records in the 800-meter and 200-meter freestyle. He won 10 World Championship gold medals and nine Pan Pacific Championship titles. He was named the World Swimmer of the Year in 1998. 1999, and 2005, and the Australian Swimmer of the Year six times. He retired from swimming in 2008, but made a comeback in 2014 and qualified for the 2016 Olympics, becoming the oldest Australian swimmer to compete at the Games. Johnny Weissmuller comes at number six. Johnny Weissmuller is an American swimmer who was one of the first superstars of the sport. He won five Olympic gold medals, three of them in the 100-meter freestyle at the 1924 and 1928 Games, becoming the first swimmer to win the same event at two Olympics. He also won the 400-meter freestyle and the 4x 200-meter freestyle relay in 1924 and 1928 setting world records in all four events. He was undefeated in his international swimming career, winning 52 national titles and setting 67 world records. He was also a water polo player, winning a bronze medal at the 1924 Olympics. He retired from swimming in 1929 and became a Hollywood actor, most famously playing Tarzan in 12 movies from 1932 to 1948. He was inducted into the International Swimming Hall of Fame and the United States Olympic Hall of Fame. At number five, we have Peter Van Den Hoogenband. He is a Dutch swimmer who is one of the most successful sprint freestylers of all time. He won the 100-meter freestyle at the 2000 and 2004 Olympics, becoming the fourth swimmer to achieve this feat. He also won the 200-meter freestyle in 2000, beating the local favorite Ian Thorpe in a thrilling race. He won a total of seven Olympic medals, including three silvers and one bronze. He set world records in the 100m and 200-meter freestyle and was the first swimmer to break the 48-second barrier in the 100-meter. He won 13 World Championship medals and 16 European Championship titles. He was named the World Swimmer of the Year in 1999 and 2000 and the European Swimmer of the Year four times. He retired from swimming in 2008 and became a sports ambassador and commentator. At number 4, Alexander Popov. He is a Russian swimmer who is widely considered as the greatest sprint freestyler of all time. He won the 50-meter and 100-meter freestyle at the 1992 and 1996 Olympics 
becoming the first swimmer to win both events at two Olympics. He also won four silver medals in the 4x 100m freestyle and medley relays. He held the world record in the 50m and 100m freestyle for six and nine years, respectively and was the first swimmer to break the 22-second barrier in the 50-meter and the 49-second barrier in the 100-meter. He won 21 World Championship medals and 14 European Championship titles. He was named the World Swimmer of the Year in 1993 and 1994 and the European Swimmer of the Year six times. He retired from swimming in 2005 and became a member of the International Olympic Committee and the President of the Russian Swimming Federation. At number three we have Ian Thorpe. Ian Thorpe is an Australian swimmer who is one of the most decorated and popular athletes of his generation. He won the 400-meter freestyle at the 2000 and 2004 Olympics, becoming the second swimmer to achieve this feat. He also won the 200-meter freestyle in 2004, beating his rivals Peter Van Den Hoogenband and Michael Phelps in a race dubbed the Race of the Century. He won a total of nine Olympic medals, including five golds, three silvers, and one bronze. He set world records in the 200-meter, 400-meter, and 800-meter freestyle, and was the first swimmer to break the 340 barrier in the 400 meter and the 145 barrier in the 200 meter. He won 13 World Championship gold medals and 10 Commonwealth Games titles. He was named the World Swimmer of the Year in 1998, 1999, 2001, and 2002 and the Australian of the Year in 2000. He retired from swimming in 2006 but made a comeback in 2011 and attempted to qualify for the 2012 Olympics, but failed to do so. He retired again in 2013 and became a philanthropist and an advocate for mental health and LGBT rights. At number two we have Michael Phelps. Michael Phelps is an American swimmer who is widely regarded as the greatest Olympian of all time. Olympic medals, the most by any athlete in any sport. He set world records in 13 individual events and was the first swimmer to break the two o'clock barrier. He was named the World Swimmer of the Year seven times times and the American Swimmer of the Year 11 times. He retired from swimming after the 2012 London Olympics, swimming champion at the age of 31. He retired for good after the Rio Games and became a businessman and a philanthropist. At number one is Mark Spitz. Mark Spitz is an American swimmer who is widely considered as the greatest swimmer of all time. He won nine Olympic gold medals, including seven in a single games at the 1972 Munich Olympics, a record that stood until 2008. He also won a total of 11 Olympic medals, including two silvers and one bronze. He set world records in all seven events he won in 1972, and also held the world records in the 100-meter and 200-meter freestyle and the 100-meter butterfly. He won 31 national titles and nine Pan American Games titles. He was named the World Swimmer of the Year three times and the Sports Illustrated Sportsman of the Year in 1972. He retired from swimming after the Munich Games at the age of 22 and became a celebrity and a motivational speaker. He was inducted into the International Swimming Hall of Fame and the United States Olympic Hall of Fame.